What's up guys, Josh here, and welcome to the first Newbie Slayer Efficiency Guide, and I've started this series on my Iron Man account, which of course means that I will not be trading at all, and therefore my gear is obviously substandard and not what you should get if you can help it. Um, I'm just using Spider Silk and a Slayer staff for this task, and it works pretty well, although I do have 66 mage, but um, it's quite hard to get decent mage gear at this point in my Iron Man account, so just, just remember that um, although I feel this advice is the best way to do the task, you definitely want to have better gear than what I have. And I feel like I'm going to have to repeat that at the start of every video, because someone's going to comment every time, but anyway. Uh, Kura, Kurasks are uh, not a very commonly done monster outside of Slayer, and they've got some semi-decent drops, but overall I'd stay clear of them if you don't have it as a Slay task. But if you do have it as a Slay task, it's quite good. So there's two ways to get there. And the first is the easiest, and that's using the Ring of Slayer, and you would just rub it and go to the Relicus Slave... <laughs> slave? Slayer Caves? <laughs> and the other way is to go to the Fairy Ring, and this is the way I would suggest most people getting there, because um, if you're a low-level, Ring of Slaying is quite annoying to get. And you're just going to want to go to AJR which will take you directly to the Slayer Caves, where the ring would otherwise teleport you. So, um, if you can help it, you can, if you have lots of Slay Rings, it's better just to teleport directly there. But if not, Fairy Rings work. And if that's not gonna work for you, you can also use the Relica Lodestone and just go a little bit to the southeast until you come to the cave. Alright, so once we're in here, we just follow the winding path all the way around. Of course if you have the agility level you can use the shortcuts, but I imagine if you're a low level slayer you probably won't have the agility level required, which is like level 80 agility, JGX logic. And we're going to come around here and all the way around. And here we go. So it's worth mentioning that although I'm using a Slayer Staff and using the Slayer Dart magic spell, you can also use Leaf Bladed Weapons. And although that works fairly well, Mage is much more efficient and um, it's much easier when you have Run Energy just to do it because you will take no damage at all. So now that we're here, of course, make sure you've got Slay Dart selected, and it's as easy as this. Just running around, gathering them up as you hit them. If you can get the Combust on, it's going to do a lot of damage. It basically kills them all, like, all, all on its own. So we're just going to run around, and uh, obviously this is very easy with Revolution. So just keep going, use thresholds whenever you have them, and you'll see that I brought some food, but I don't really need it, as I could just get away with picking up the bananas that they drop and eating them, but um, just in case, and plus this is the preset. So the only drops really to look out for here are, of course, the broad arrows if you want to pick them up. But they drop a few rune items and leaf bladed weapons, which will out for a decent amount of coin, but otherwise they're um pretty average really. Nothing incredibly special about them. Decent XP. You know, 115 Slayer XP per kill, and they're fairly quick to kill and pretty easy, so it's a decent mid-level task, I'd say. Um Nothing really ultra special, but gets you the XP, so nothing to complain about. And this really is all there is to it, guys. Um, if you guys have any specific newbie monsters that you want me to 
make a video on, uh, I would be glad to do so. And if you have any suggestions or comments, leave them in the video description or comment box rather. And if you want to talk to me at all, ask me any questions, I'll answer any questions you have. Or if you just want to say hi, add me on my main account, Draco Orata, or add this account, which is Iron Merba, and I will gladly talk. So thanks for watching, guys. I really appreciate it, and I'll see you guys next time.